Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video tutorial, we are going to learn about update query and PHP and MySQL. So this is the code from our previous tutorial in which we have uh, connected to the database successfully and we have uh, retrieved some data and shown. So um, this is the up to here connected successfully and this is the code for connection and uh, down here the code is a bit different so I'll remove this and we will rewrite the code so I'll remove this now we are good to go so right here we will create uh, a query so dollar discable equals and now uh, let me first show you the uh, tables so I've started the them control panel and I started Apache and PHP my admin. So now if I go to this browser, I have opened PHP my admin and uh, we have this test DB and we have inserted and retrieved data from this DB table. Now if I show you this, now we have these two records. So we will update this uh, second record. Uh, we will change the name and the if name to some other name. So uh, I'll go to Visual Studio Code and here we will write our query update and then we have to provide our uh, table name so which is a db table and then we will use set um, and uh, we will use the name equals single quote single quote and we will provide the name here so I'll provide mother sir and we will also update the father name so i'll use comma f name equals and single quote single quote and here i will pass in uh, a pawn and now i'll put semicolon at the end now we will execute this query but we have missed you know, one thing in this uh, we are clause so we are we are id equals two because we are we want to update only uh, this second record with this id two so um i'll go again to our uh, php script and now here I will use uh, if dollar mysqli and query and here I will pass in the mm, dollar is given so dollar is given and then I'll print print if and here I will pass in uh, record updated and now I'll put semicolon and uh, if there is an error so we will show the error if um, dollar mysqli and error number error norm and then we will uh, print f and here we will pass in error occurred and here i will be passing a comma and now dollar dollar my scale i and then we will use error and I'll put semicolon at the end and now all control is it now this is a mysql example.php file so I'll go to our um, browser to this one I'll open a new tab and now here I will use a localhost this one and now connected record updated so now we will go to our uh, 
uh, PHP Madman. And now if I refresh this, and let's see, now you can see the record is updated to Mudassir and father name to Khan. So in this way, we can use update query in PHP and MySQL. So I think that's all for today. I hope you like the video. If you like the video, please like, subscribe and comment. Thank you.